guys, I've got myself a set of wild game meat sticks. These are meat sticks that are made out of very strange materials. Uh, and by materials, I mean animals. Within the bag, there are 12 different flavors. Now what's great about all of these flavors, they're all gluten-free and there's no MSG. Let's go to town. I will start with duck. This is duck and pork, um, arguably my two favorite proteins just stacked. Uh, so I think I will love this. This is bison and pork with chipotle. Whoa, this is a really nice flavor. I mean, I could just go to town on these things. I got myself a jackalope. It smells like a meat stick, but like a lot more flavor. I'm guessing it has a bit of a spicy ting to it, a little bit of zest. Oh man, this is good. Very lovely smoke flavor. Definitely a little gamey. Like you get the duck, which I love, well seasoned, but not too salty. I find sometimes these kind of products are like, water, please. Not this. If you've ever had homemade kind of meat sticks from people who hunt, this is very, very similar. While I finish up eating the bison, I'm gonna eat some pheasant. Not really too much of a zest. It definitely has a, like a salty flavor to it. And the meat's really good. This contains venison, again, deer meat, pork, rabbit, and brown sugar. I could have sworn there was some jack-o'-lantern in there. All right, bubs, it's roadkill time. I guess if you can hit it with your car, it's in this meat stick. The duck was a very clean flavor. Um, it's like you can smell the asphalt. That's so good. So this one is definitely not spicy. This is very, I would say very neutral. It's better than a Slim Jim. There's more flavor, there's more like, you feel like there's more that you're eating with each bite. This one is spicier? Maybe a jalapeno truck is what finally did the critters in? If you want to know more about all the meat that you can eat off the side of the road, like and subscribe so I can tell you about it. Fat19.com